When are you two leaving? Tomorrow morning. First thing. Oh, there's some food on the stove. I saw, Alma. You shouldn't have bothered, dear. It's no bother at all, ma'am. We're kind of leaving you without much of a notice ahead of time. I didn't feel right about it, so I thought I'd at least cook for you. It'll keep you going for a few days. What will I do without you? <laughs> Give me your blessing. Hey, God bless you, ma'am. God bless you, even if I don't have any right to say that to you anymore. God bless you. Hey, Mason, come on, man. I have other things to do. Do we have to stare at this all day? Now try the other hall. Then we'll check the entrance to the garden. There are two cameras. There are 22 cameras in total, Mason. It's just too much. Talk for just a minute, please. Of course. Why does Mr. Mason want to talk to Kareem? I don't know, but I think it's something about Daphne. Something strange is going on, Layla. First, there's what Martin said. Then there's what Mr. Mason implied. I'm so confused about things. Is there anything you know? Look, Layla, please tell me if you know something about my sister. We hadn't spoken in many years, but Daphne was my sister. I have every right to know if something happened to her. I didn't want to force Kareem to talk, but I believe the time has come. I don't want to cover up or put off anything any longer. Concert. Listen if you want to. How lovely. But would it be all right if you continue with the concert later, Jasmine? Huh? Auntie Sally's here right now, and we're going to talk to your brother for a little bit. You can talk to me, too. We will, we will. You go to your room and prepare the dollies. We'll come and play with you in a while, okay? Come on, my girl. Hmm? Okay, then, Mom. I'll be waiting for you. Okay. Mom, what do you want to talk about? Please have a seat, honey. I'm going to ask you something important, Kareem. When you were away, one of those men called me once. You had said something about your uncle. You said you had seen your aunt and things. Is this true? Kareem? Kareem? You can tell me everything. There's no need to be scared. But I already told Dad about it. Didn't he tell you what I said? Then he came after me and told me not to tell anyone anything. 
He said, you never came here, and you never saw me either. I was going to tell you about it, but I didn't have the opportunity. Besides that day, it's okay, baby. It's okay. We need to inform the police about this. I'll tell them everything I know. Baby. I had no idea you hated me so much. So you did all of this, what did you gain, huh? All you did was ruin both of our lives. What I don't get is what you wanted from William. Why kill him? He overheard me talking to Aldo. He called and blackmailed me. So you decided it would be best to kill him? I didn't. I only told Aldo what he said to me on the phone. I just panicked. Aldo said he would sort it out for me. I didn't know how he was going to do it. I didn't know he'd make you do it. Then I saw you on the DVD. Oh, Aaron. I'm not William's murderer. You are. 